Hello, I'm Leslie Logan, and I'm going to teach you how to do the advancement for your kneeling pushdown, also known as your washwoman. So as I mentioned, this is an advancement. This is not something that you must do. This is not something that everybody should do. It is something that is out there to take this exercise to the next level. Should you need it? Should it actually improve your practice? And I say that because in Pilates, it can draw the perfectionist out of all of us. And we think I have to do every exercise perfectly. And the truth is, is that some exercises are really great for some bodies and not awesome for others because they're depending on where you are in your practice and what you need more of, okay? So this particular exercise, I actually really love for my body, but on some other bodies, it might not be actually be where they are yet in their practice or ever in their practice. And that's okay, right? So you would typically do this from your last set of your kneeling pushdown or your washwoman. So again, whatever spring setting you've used, um, I'm on one top because I don't have a spotter. You could be on one middle if you have a spotter or one top if you need it, right? I have the heels together, but you can do this parallel hip distance apart. I do squeeze my legs towards each other, even though they're apart, arms up, and I'm going to round forward trying to keep my hips over my knees as I get set up because they like to sit back when I'm coming into the exercise. I use the pedal in the spring to help me get my hips over my knees. And then you would do a few reps of your washerwoman. And then before you come out of it, you reach down and then you shave, you pump the pedal, keeping those hips over those knees. So the hard part is, is I'm losing the spring. I don't have the spring to hold the shape. My body has to hold the shape. And then when I finish, I finish with straight arms. I lift my arms up and I try to keep my hips over my knees as I come up. So doing that shave really helps you if you struggle with a long flexion, if you struggle with keeping those connections when the spring is closed, it gives you this extra moment to try to keep it. And you don't really have a choice because if you lose it, you're not going to like being up there. <laughs> so for more tips like these, check out all the flashcards we have at onlinepliesclasses.com, Matt, Reformer, Cadillac, and Tower, plus the chairs deck that includes all the chairs. We also have amazing workouts like on your window chair. Um, and we love to help you do life better.